Welcome, in front of me is Huawei Media Pod M5 Lite and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through recovery mode. Now, that being said, this will also allow you to get rid of a screen lock, so if you have one set that you don't know, you can remove it this way. Now, with that being said, let's start off by turning off our device, so we're gonna hold our power button and... There we go and then select power off. And when the device turns off, you want to hold your power button and the volume up at the same time. After a moment, you will see a Huawei logo on the screen, at which point you can let go of the power button, but keep holding volume up. As you can see, this will take us to the recovery mode. I'm gonna kind of cut off the top of the display, but there's nothing there as you can see. So anyway, in here, we're simply gonna select wipe data factory reset, and it will tell us to type in yes to confirm it. So just simply type in, as you can see, it shows up right here, and then we can select factory reset. Um, if you're, okay, so this is another probably inf important information to some people. So this will remove Google, or uh, it will remove screen lock, but if you're also logged into a Google account, um, it will basically mean that the device will become FRP locked. And uh, at that point, you would basically need to verify either one of those, so screen lock or Google account once the reset is finished, when you go into the setup of it. If you don't know either one of those, uh, the device basically becomes unusable to you because you won't ever be able to actually finish up the setup, so you'll be stuck on it. So yeah, basically, if you're logged in into Google account, uh, you will need to enter your Google password uh, to access your device after resetting uh, factory settings. Anyway, I'm gonna confirm this by selecting wipe data. As you can see, this begins factory resetting it. I believe it only gets like 10 or 20%, something along those lines, and then it automatically becomes finished. More, a little bit more. Oh, there we go. So about 23. And once it's finished, and you're taking back the main page right here, you want to simply select Reboot System Now. This will initiate a reboot of the device and then puts you into the Android after a moment once it's done uh, doing whatever it's doing in the background with the factory reset, which at that point will present us with the setup screen for our device. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.